Corey. Welcome to Aiken. Hey, let's go see some classrooms. Uh, let's go. I'll show you around. Awesome. You're famous. You're famous. <laughs> like, what's this spectacle? What is a ladybug? I saw your painting ladybugs over there. Have you guys had your turn to paint your ladybug yet? I had it. You haven't had your turn or you did? Yes. <gasps> is that is that where they live? What's this gonna be? The ladybug's habitat. Oh wow, what a big word. The ladybug's habitat. What does that mean? What the Oh, that they're going to live in here. This is their habitat. Wow. Kiss your brain. Mwah. You guys are amazing. Thank you for sharing your ladybug habitat with me. We give out awards to kids doing the right thing. And so they, what we call earn your wings. Every child has an opportunity every day to earn their wings. What did you do? You have always been on task. Congratulations. High five. Nice job. Get your hands up for me and top up the word hand. And wow, nice job. Now I want job. you to take that hand and I want you to change it to a, from a mm, to a t, 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 t. Ooh, ooh. Show me that. Cat. So even in kindergarten when they're sitting and, and learning, it's still in, I still saw engaging, like they had the, the, the tactiles, the whiteboard, and then also the teacher had different strategies for, you know, just getting attention and moving through the lesson. D-A-T. Is that what you had? So give a double clap. You saw today that there was a lot of movement. There was also a lot of Kagan structure. So very intentional about how to group the kids and then how to regroup the kids and how to um, get them to other kids and collaborate with one another using those Kagan structures. And um, our kindergarten team does an amazing job with that. One of the things we're um, celebrating as a campus is our um, diversity here on campus. And so we just finished this bulletin board and we're excited about it. It is a way to celebrate our students in different cultures. And we have, as you can see on the board, many students from all across the world. And this is how to say um, hello and goodbye in many different languages. When we talk about growth in Leander ISD, we talk about like neighborhoods around Aiken Elementary. Absolutely. We are growing by leaps and bounds and we're not just growing with students from the Texas area, but from really all across the United States and across the world. What do you like about social studies? Different things about the world. Yeah, it kind of opens your eyes to all of the things in the world that maybe you didn't know. Yeah. So what do you guys learn in fifth grade in history? You're doing uh, World War One now, is it all? We learned, we learned about the Civil War and World War One. So it's American history? And Ms. Peterson, no shock. They love social studies because their teacher loves social studies too. <laughs> That's what they said. What I loved about what we saw was that the kids were working in collaborative groups. Uh -huh. And then what I also loved was that there was an opportunity re for reflection. So if they didn't get something, that was their opportunity to do like a gallery walk yeah. in that instruction. And those kids were able to see what other kids had created. So I love that about that lesson. And there's true ownership in that classroom of student work and student abilities and collaboration and that is absolutely how that class functions. We're here to talk a little bit about how the library this year has um, made a difference in our kids lives. So we print out a list of all of our student requests and then we start pulling the books and then we wrap our books with our students first name grade level so it's easy for them to identify and it also provides a certain amount of confidentiality for them and, and some excitement and some excitement present. too that's true we wrap them up on valentine's day we put valentine they ribbons on them so we get cute. very crafty in here with our wrappings i have a four-year-old at home and i can tell you that gift wrapping is like an ingenious <laughs> extra touch because it's christmas every day it is yeah. christmas and we have our friends we write notes to you and they write notes to us and we stick bookmarks in we just want them to feel that connection to us i have one that here. says mrs sinha thank you so much for the book recommendations i enjoyed the lemon wars and i'm enjoying saving winslow thank you so much so sometimes they need help because yeah. they can't peruse all the books and even though you get a chance to look it up online it's a little different so we'll make book recommendations and Here's two that you requested, and here's one that I think might work for you. So we have our mobile carts over here at the entrance to the library. When they see this cart coming, they're her friends who don't have library that day. are like, wait, come back, come back. <laughs> come back. So 
These ladies are amazing. Their dedication no. to making sure kids read, amazing. Could we get them pushing the cart? <laughs> With their ice cream music. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know how you love doing slow-mo. <laughs> Thank you for coming to visit Aiken, our amazing students and our amazing teachers. We're happy to have you and we'll see you next year. I was looking for ladybugs in there. Yeah, I, was, I, was, I, was, I was a little nervous because I was like, the top's open. <laughs> We're going. <laughs> the ladybugs yeah, are out. They, they may be all over the place. We're in trouble.